Hi uh, guys, today I'm gonna do a small demo of uh, Blue Retro uh, BLE support. So BLE stands for Bluetooth Low Energy. So pretty much all new device uh, like keyboard, mouse are coming uh, with uh, that new Bluetooth specification. Also new controller like the Xbox uh, XS uh, series of BLE and as well as the Steam controller got the BLE firmware uh, upgrade available. So today I'm just gonna do a small demo of uh, playing uh, Half-Life 1 uh, on a Dreamcast using the using Valve on controller. So the first let's take a look uh, at the configuration. So the first thing we need to do is to do set the configuration. So right now the Steam controller support it's only the default uh, Lizard mode. So in that mode the uh, Steam controller uh, emulate a keyboard and a mouse with a very, very little uh, button option but that's what we got for now so I created a, a preset a Dreamcast FPS Team Controller Laser Mode so I'm just gonna save that to output one and then we can go in advanced config and take a look in detail uh, what it's doing so when we look at the Back in config, we can see the uh, the mouse uh, X axis and uh, Y axis being mapped to output number two of the dream Dreamcast, and then on output one, we got the uh, all the keyboard button, so and also the two mouse. So the the trigger on the Steam controller they act as a uh, as the mouse button. So those are also all mapped to the joystick output so output one so when we check the output config here so output one is a gamepad and then if we check the output two it's set to a mouse so what we're doing is the both uh, keyboard and mouse output from the steam controller they are uh, aggregated on the same uh, logical bluetooth device but uh, what we do here essentially is that we split it out so we keep uh, all the button and we send them uh, as a joystick button and then we keep only the mouse axis relative axis to be output on the on the mouse so one problem with uh, the steam controller is ammo so you don't have all the fine uh, tuning option available so hopefully in a future version of blue Retro, i'm going to be able to implement that so one of the drawbacks is that the, the mouse Sensitivity is quite high, but you get used to it. So. So that's it for the demo. I see you guys.